As MTS looks to improve the rider experience, having trains arrive on time is one of the simplest ways to do that. That's a big reason why we're launching the Copperline East County Connector this fall. The Copper Line replaces green and orange line trolley service in San Diego's East County. It runs east of El Cajon Transit Center, serving Arnell Avenue, Gillespie Field, and Santee, with trips every 15 minutes daily for most of the day. Copper Line is actually something that, you know, we've thought about for many, many years in our planning department and our operations uh, department. Primary reason that it is uh, being implemented is for the predictability of our trains to be actually on time globally. The trolley system experiences delays due to challenges with the existing Green Line service in Santee. Only one train can operate between Gillespie Station and Santee Station in both directions. So one train goes eastbound out to Santee, and the next train can't go into that single track until that train returns. If that train's delayed for any reason, it becomes a ripple effect. It becomes problematic for the global system. With the Copper Line, Green Line trolley service will now terminate at El Cajon Transit Center. Green Line riders traveling to and from Santee will need to transfer at El Cajon to use the Copper Line connector. In addition to the improved reliability riders will have, one of the biggest benefits of the Copper Line is adding more late night service and weekend service further east. Currently, it's half hour service between San Diego State and Santee in the mornings on Saturdays and Sundays. That service will be extended 15 minutes out to El Cajon. So Green Line service on weekends is gonna be enhanced as well. Trains that currently have to stop at SDSU will go all the way to El Cajon Transit Center. And in early 2025, we will be able to increase late night frequency and weekend frequencies from every 30 minutes to every 15 minutes. The Copper Line is gonna be a game changer for MTS's network globally. For passengers that are making transfers on the rail network, rail to rail, it'll be much more efficient. Passengers that are making transfers from rail to bus, the efficiency will be there. The entire network is gonna basically function much better for us, uh, and so we're really excited about that. The Copper Line East County Connector begins service this fall. To learn more about this service and the other ways how MTS is now better transit, go to sdmts.com. Thank you for choosing transit.